Okay, let's get started. Okay, let's begin. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my session. The topic is building an active inner source community is crucial for inner source. First, let me introduce myself a little bit. My name is Tan Zhong Yi. My English name is Jerry, so you can call me Jerry Tan. I'm from China. I have more than 20 years experience with open source software and open source community. I'm a committer of Mozilla, GNOME, and Apache Software Foundation. I was a former open source leader of Baidu company. I'm also an advocate of inner source in China. I'm an organizer of inner source China working group. Here's my agenda. First, I'll talk about what is inner source and an inner source community? Then I'll talk about why we need to do one. Then how to build and how to measure. Then I'll talk about my practices inside Baidu, including the community user model, plan, practices, and the results. Last summary and uh, questions. So, what is inner source? Inner source is the use of open source software development best practices and the establishment of an open source like culture within organizations. The organizations may still develop proprietary software, but internally opens up its development. This definition is from Wikipedia. It's a little Complicate. In a short, inner source is adopting the Apache way inside an organization. This is much easier to understand. This definition is given by Dennis Cooper, the open source diva, who make inner source very popular in recent years. So, what is the inner source community? Inner source community is one type of user community. It's inside an organization. Most of the members are engineers, plus employees from legal, strategy, and HR departments. They share the same value of inner source, the Apache way. I know every Apache guys may have a different understanding of the Apache way. Here is my understanding of the Apache way. Apache way encoding the mission, provide software for the public good, the core value, community over code, principles, collaborative software development, and the commercially friendly standard license and so on. And it also has uh, best practices and conventions, such as using mail list and the voting when needed. It's a whole bunch of missions, value, principles, and best practices. But for me, the most uh, why inner source follows Apache way? Because they believe with the core value of the open source can make it happy, make it successful. That is community over code. We need to make it open, we need to make it transparent, and we need collaborate to make a inner source. So why inner source community is important? Here's one model of inner source model. To make it successful, we need both 
executive support from the top down and the internal community bottom up. Both are needed. Sometimes executive support is easy to get, but internal community support is much harder. Why? Because it means cultural shift. Cultural shift is never easy. So why we need it very much? Why I say an active community, inner source community is crucial because we need an atmosphere to emphasize everything that open source is important. We need a community to let internal developers to fund their users, their contributors, their partners. We also need the community to let contributors to feel respected and belongings, to recognize their merits. Here is the needs of inner source community users. I use the graph of Maslow's hierarchy of needs. It divides people's needs into five layers. Here is the third layer of needs, belonging, and love leading. So we need to make our inner source users feel that they belong to this community. For the level two, we need to make them feel that they are respected in this community. And for the first level needs, the contributor's contribution needs to get recognized so they think their values have been success successfully self-fulfilled. So how to judge if an inner source community is active? It's very many, very easy. It needs to through many peoples, from directors, from VPs to normal engineers, from engineers, from HRs, from QE, from product manager many kinds of rules. Second, many is many interactions. Interactions on RM, on forum, and on online and offline events. The third many is many contributions, patches, issues, documentations, tests, and feedbacks are all welcome. So, how to build an active inner source community? Please remember, it's one type of user community, but it has its own characteristics. The users come from the same company, so the, the reputation is very important. The target of inner source community is not for revenue because you cannot make money from internal employees. Instead, it's for user contributions to help inner source practice in the organizations. Here is the model of AARR models. We need to adapt it a little bit within inner source community. The first A is acquisitions. It means how do users fund you? In inner community, we need to turn normal employees into inner source web users. The second A is activations. It means do users have a general first experience? In inner source community, it means let the Users participate in all kinds of events. The, the R is the retentions, means do users use it subsequently? 
in Inos community, we need to provide the Inos users fresh contents and tasks. The second R is revenue. How do we make money? But in Inos community, we don't make money. We need to incentive Inosus community guys to contribute more to our Inosus projects. And the last is refer. Do users tell others? In Inosus community, we encourage the users to to influence more people to contribute. Here is the whole AI model in Inosus community. The operational task is the same. We need content operations, event operations, and user operations. They need to be combined, combined together to make operations successfully. Okay, let me talk about Baidu's inner source journey. Baidu is the largest search, largest search engine in China. Some people, some people may say it's Chinese Google. It has more than 10,000 engineers. From 2016, it adopted inner source to improve their internal technical platforms. Here's the schedules. First, it um, began its first uh, open inner source project, first pilot project. Then I began to build an inner source community for only one project. Then we adopted it to the whole department. It means it has three sub three hundred engineers and the man projects. I accelerated to build more and the bigger communities. Then InnoSource you know, is adapting to the whole company. I need to make the community more bigger and uh, reach a climax. Here is the user model analysis and task I made for my inner source journey. I divided my people into five layers. Layer five, all employees. For layer five, the operation is acquisition. I send out regular emails with training and even related. I need to turn them into inner source community users. Level four is inside the community. I need to activate them and retain them. So I organize events with no entry and I organize technical trainings and boot camps. The third layer is active users. They discussion, they are communicating, they collaborate in the community. So for level three, I intensive co contributions. I organize inner source contests and hackernet to let this active user to contribute more. The level two is contributors. For level two, I incentive refer. PRs for individuals and the building stars. And the top layer is opinion leaders. These opinion leaders have a great influence inside the company. They can influence many engineers to contribute. So for level one, I enlarge their influence. I give them many opportunities for our inner source. I will encourage them to participate 
in many events such as Apache Kong, Kubo Kong, or meet with the uh, famous guys such as Linus Torvalds. Here's my principles. Since I'm building inner source community, so I need to adopt the inner source ways to build it. So I follow the same core values. The operation needs to be open, transparent, and collaborated. And also, I need dog food. I need to eat the dog food. I need to take part team. It means I need to be one member of the in the inner source community. Here is the detail of the action plan. I use interesting or hard code content to attract new users to join the community. Using all kinds of events, daily, monthly, yearly, to activate the user engagement, to let them participate and contribute. The third one is recognize opinion leaders and good contributors, let them feel respected and encourage them to refer so we can extend more users. For daily operations, send out topics in our chat groups every day. These topics are related with open source, related with current trends. To stimulate discussion in chat group, to let the members feel that the community is active, the atmosphere is great. Then, here is some monthly operations. I'm inviting famous person to share with face to face. There's some international, for example, the NIST Foundation, CNCF Foundation, OpenStack Foundation, their CEOs such as Jim Zamley or Dan Cole. When they visit the Battle Campus, I may invite them to give us a speech to, to share with our Unisource community guys. And also, I will invite some domestic people, that, that are several Apache members in China, such as uh, Wu Sheng, Jiang Ning, and Zhang Liang. I invite them to Battle Campus to share with us. They may share what is Apache Foundation, how it operates, and what is the Apache way and their projects. And also, I organize boot camp for hot technical topics, building brandings, such as deep learning boot camps, Kubernetes boot camps. Here is the quarterly or yearly operations. I organize yearly inner source competition for developers. It has been organized three consecutive years. By the end of the event, I invited our COO, Lu Qi, and the co-founder as the award presenter to reward these winners. And I also organized some events such as Hacker Night for developers. It was just like Hackathon. It's, it's a one night event with a sound test. Engineers will come in and to finish this. Their output can be used by all engineers. When they're done, they have a special hacker medal on their profile page. 
just like uh, GitHub, a uh, personal profile page. And uh, I also organize some activities for all users with no threshold and high participation, such a satisfying slogan and the production of commuting culture shirt t-shirt. Here's one case. So the scientist slogan. Slogan is important. It's easy to remember. And so the scientist slogan is easy to let the user to participate. I organized this event last for one month. First, we announced it to a society slogan. Then we got over 100 options. Then we vote for the top 10. The top 10 winners can vast for themselves and then the community vote again. Then the last winner came out. The whole event lasted for one month and uh, 1,000 users participate is very popular. Here's the result, slogan, here's the slogan. Because of open source, we made it simple. Here's the reason why we made the winner. Because it was related with Baidu's value. Baidu's value is simple and reliable. So connected with the core value will make the people easy to remember and easy to understand. And the second reason is because code is open, we can work on the same code base. So collaboration is so simple. So at last we choose this token because of open source, we make it simple. It's a very, very perfect. Here is the another case, Kubernetes bootcamp. Because engineers is interested in cloud native, hoping to get started very quickly. So I organized this Kubernetes bootcamp for beginners. I made the outlines started to recruit volunteers internally because I cannot uh, give this course all by myself. I need volunteer. Finally, we got seven volunteers to train our engineers. These volunteers are great. They write the, the papers, they prepare the course and uh, write scripts and then give it speech. The cost contents and the scripts are all in our source. We got many contributions from our students. We organized 10 more training courses, all got very high customer satisfactions. The community all loves this course. It becomes our branding cause. Here's another case, the website of Baidu Open Source. The host name is opensource.baidu.com. It's a fully commuting driving project. Volunteer user spare time to complete. The team includes one engineer, one front-end engineer, one PM, and one QA. It's all recruited from the community. They just want to contribute their spare time to make it happy. The process is simple. One day, I sit down notice that said, we need to make a portal for our open source community. Any volunteer are welcome. Then I got a four. 
when the team is built up, I make a simple kickoff. The project manager define the prototype. Then the engineer to get to work. They develop and a test and uh, for internal test. Finally, we officially launch it. It's a total committed joint project with all com volunteers. It's a great example of how people can do it together. Here is the results. Three is nature. There are 3,000 more users in the industrial community, accounting for 30% for all engineers. We have very active trust on RM. 1,000 plus more messages every day. It's very popular. The contributions to our inner source project are great. And a lot of people become stars. They have spun up to external community, including Zhang Wenli. Zhang Wenli is a girl focused on each child's project. She has become the GitHub star. She's one of the first GitHub star in the world. Here are the summarize of three years operations inside Baidu. The good one is that atmosphere was great. We trained a lot of engineers. They become very popular. They, they become very familiar with open source community and they loved open source. And we also developed many projects. Many open source, many projects in also the first, then open source to external community. Then they become uh, Apache software foundation projects. Also, there are some badness. The acquisition is still not good. Coverage is not enough. I plan to cover 50%, uh, but we didn't reach that number. And that the operation is not far enough. Okay. Here is the thing, building belonging into the social economy. This is the book I learned a lot from John Bacon, The Art of Community. Okay, any questions?